there are a number of things that will surprise people. I think when they pick up an, uh, the reporting of the Revolutionary War and they see the fact that uh, they cover a lot of material in a short amount of space, uh, you have the layout's different, the content is different. I mean, you have a lot of things that are written more like essays than news stories, and that is very different from today. Uh, the use of pseudonyms rather than reporters' names uh, is something that took me a while to get used to. Uh, but I think they also uh, just, uh, one of the things that will take getting used to is the fact that the English language hasn't been standardized by this point, and so, you know, in one paragraph a word spelled this way, and in another paragraph it's spelled another way, and so it gets very uh, difficult to deal with. Uh, and, you know, if they see the actual newspapers, then the typefaces get really strange and look different and weird because it varies from place to place. Uh, I, it took me years to get used to the fact that there is a, a particular typeface that you, for an S that looks like an F, and it makes it very difficult to read if you're not paying attention to what you're doing. Uh, 